Hello and welcome back to Storytime Gamer. We're going to play some Resident Evil 4 Remake today. I'm so excited about this game. I've pretty much played it ever since it came out on the GameCube. I didn't try it on the PlayStation 2, watch my friends play it. But then I picked it up again on the PlayStation 4. I mean, it's just a great game, classic game, but it set a precedent for so many other games that came after it. But let's just dive right in. So excited. September 30th, 1998. It's a day I'll never forget. The cop inside me died that day. And that night, Raccoon City was wiped out, thanks to the bioweapons created by Umbrella. Somehow I made it out, but too many others weren't so lucky. I was asked later to join a top secret government program. Not that I had a choice. Training, punishing missions, nearly killed me. But at least they kept my mind off everything. If I could just forget what happened that night, the pain, even for a second, this time it can be different. It has to. So tell me, Yankee, why did you come to this horrible place? As close to nowhere that I've ever seen. Let's just say, looking for someone. That someone must be very important, huh? The chief gave the orders himself. Help him, he said. I'm sure your boys didn't come all the way out here to roast marshmallows. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe you did. You have a strange sense of humor. I'm gonna let you in on a little secret, just between us. A lot of people have gone missing around here, and it's been that way for a while now. Well then, should be just another day in the office, right? Mm. I mean, last week there was a search for some missing hikers. I'm sure you'll do your best to help me. <laughs> Your calls, huh? I'll be right back. <sighs> yeah. Qué frío. ¿Te has bebido el bar entero? <laughs> you smoke? Vaya sitio más tétrico. ¡Eh! ¿Hay alguien ahí? He sure is taking his time. Did he fall in? Maybe you better go and take a look. Uh, 
Oh, what's the car? Wouldn't want to get a parking ticket. So much for helping me. And just like that, we are back in the nightmare. He was taking so long. Well, I played the demo of this, and this looks far more superior than the demo version did. Granted, I put on um, ray tracing, uh, the fidelity, because I really like that a lot more. Um, How but this, far could he have gone? You can definitely tell that it's been polished up since the demo, which is an awesome thing. Ugh. Ugh. What I said. I'm wondering if I could see one of those birds calling. And it seems to be at the high frame rate when it needs to be for this, um... For it even being fidelity, but this fog is amazing. Cause I don't. This fog wasn't in the the demo itself. It's so creepy. Now, one fun thing. I'm not gonna. I'm gonna go ahead and tell you. I'm not gonna keep talking about. Well, this wasn't in the original. This wasn't in the original. It's been forever since I've played the original version of this game. That um, there's certain things that do stand out, and I'll be like, oh, cool. They shorten that up. I'll say something like that. But. I can tell from the demo. One interesting thing is that anyone home? When Resident Evil Village came out, you can see all the inspiration it took from Resident Evil 4, the original. And now it's kind of come full circle and from the demo and from like this, it's like wow, it reminds me so much of Resident Evil Village. Ugh. Se queda el juicio. Judgment is nigh. Okay. Good to know. Glad the judgment is nigh. Hasta el fin vetremos contigo... No Ramos. I'm curious to know what that says. Wish I had my Google Translate right in front of me. Maybe I'll look it up later. Sorry to barge in like this. Busco a un policía. Vino aquí. Not Mario. Oh, dang, Leon. Well, I guess I'll just take this key. This not good. No, it's not. Man, that stinks. Ew, that looks disgusting. It looks like there's like lumps of flesh or something weird in there. Like rotten flesh. <laughs> Poor guy. Mario. The one nice thing is that you don't have to hold down a button to pull out the knife. You just, if you're not aiming, it seems like it'll go ahead and just use it to cut. Which is a nice, uh, update from what it used to be. And I'll take that. 
Ugh. That's a big rat. Ooh. He's like, not again. Oh, man. Yeah, this does not look good. All right, let's get out of here. What was that? No fucking way. Turn off your flashlight there, Leon. I think I can sneak past all these guys. Yee. Alright, let's go. That's a nice new element, is uh, the sneaking. Reminds me a little bit more of what was introduced um, in The Evil Within. You could sneak around a lot of places and kind of uh, do stealth kills on your enemies. Bruce, this is Gondor One. Hunnigan here, what's your sit rep? The president's daughter, Baby Eagle. It's likely she's in this village. Our intel was correct then, well done. Need a location on a nearby lake. She may have been taken there. Copy that. I'll see what I can find. Hurry up. Something's happened to the people here. My escorts are... <laughs> Gotta go. Talk later. I'll let myself out. <laughs> <laughs> Classic Leon. Jeez. Uh oh. Ooh, ew. That blood, that's not good. Not good at all. Kaka! <laughs> Yay, handgun ammo. Now I do appreciate I don't have to keep pulling out the knife to crack open some crates. And uh we get to do more crafting just like in yeah, saving item storage. Ooh, I love the min the save music. Oh, that's beautiful. I'm gonna start doing save. Customize case. Increase drop of. Oh, okay. Nice. So yeah, that's something new is uh, the, the case. Like there's different cases I guess you get from the the merchant. You get different perks and stuff like that. Go ahead and organize this just a little. And the knife um, has a durability on it. So the more I use it, the it loses it and I have to get it fixed. 
at the merchant, from what I understand, and then you can pick up like other knife types that are disposable. Ooh. Oh no, the wolf! I guess this is like a reference to the the wolf you help out in the, so in the original game you can help out a wolf or, or not help out a wolf. Ugh. And if you help out the wolf it comes and helps you in a, in a later boss fight, but looks like they're like, no wolves helping you today. Alright. Now there's some guys up here. I'm gonna run past them. And not waste my ammo. Un forastero! And there's a trap here I'm gonna try to avoid. There it is. Yeah. <laughs> now this guy. Just ignore him. Oop. Grab the herb. And let's get into the village. Save myself some ammo because I'm gonna need it here in the just a second. Ugh. Hello, welcome! Ooh. And look, they're not gonna follow me. Ooh. Poor guy. I don't even know what his name is. Oop, we're gonna sneak around this way. Not try to get the attention of everybody. Item crafting. Certain materials such as resources, gunpowder, and knives can be used to craft different items. The type of items that you can craft can be increased by obtaining new crafting recipes. So, if I wanted to craft, it's nice it has a list of it, so it's not like, well, what are the recipes? Um, you can combine it together. And what the the biggest thing we need to get are these yellow ones because that increases our overall health. Um, and my old strategy would be to mix this and then wait for a yellow herb together. But it looks like you can't. It makes it seem like you can't mix into the green until you get a yellow and a red together. So maybe I'll hold off on mixing that because I would I would hate it if like you mix the red and the green. It's like oh we can't put the yellow in there. That might be something I'll test in the future, because that seems a little dumb if you can't pre-mix two of those. And just hold off for that yellow. Chicken! Leon, you're just killing these old women that have... Ooh, the set does. They didn't do anything bad. I mean, what is he doing? You maniac, no wonder. Ooh. Hello, Jen. Nice. Didn't think I could find, like, a gem randomly like that. Excuse me, chicken. Well, the guy's just carrying around the flower. Crazy people. Excuse me? Ooh. Ahí está! Here we go. Yeah, here we go. We're just going to go ahead and run in here. It's my lucky day. Resources. Hand grenade. What do these people have all this stuff just laying down around here for? You know? Ah. Uh, 
It's like there's a hand grenade right there too. Oh, nice. Like we're just randomly gonna hold these things here. Here you go, buddy. <laughs> oh, gosh. No, 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 no. <laughs> like, we just started. Run. E, e, e. Like, I've played this demo enough times that, um, I've killed him. The Chainsaw Man. Doctor, whatever his name is. One down. Where is he? Next. This was a bad idea. Why did I jump in there? <laughs> oh gosh. Yee. All right, we need to we need to get some space here. Fill me for the repairs later. Where is Chainsaw Man? There he is. Let's see if we can find some more sh shotgun ammo somewhere. Should have held on those grenades a little longer. Great, it's just jewels. Come on. Fuck. Oh, no, 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 no. Yeah, I get it. Okay, yeah, select weapon shortcuts. I'm not ready to talk about this game. Yeesh. No. <laughs> Hold on, everybody. Let me let me let me let me organize my case uh, before we continue, please. Don't hurt me. Uh-oh. Leon might be in trouble here. I, jump? I can't jump over that, can I? Oh, I did kill him. Nice. Alright, let's just run around for a little bit here. Mmm. I'm gonna eat that egg, though. Oh, yeah. Num, num, num. Oh. Nothing for me to get into right now. Run away from these villagers. Ah. Saved by the bell. Huh? That's what I said. La campana. Alcubi de Fela. El nos invoca.
Mm-hmm. Looks like a great little church right there. Where's everyone going? Bingo? <laughs> Resident Evil Far. Sweet. And now I'm finally to a part I haven't played. Route to Condor 1. I've identified a route to the lake. Look for a large windmill. There's a path on the far side of it. Windmill. Copy that. And be careful. Roost out. Well, I do appreciate that. That's nice. Um, instead of cutting to a map updated. Alright, I'll check in a second. Oh, okay. Open map. The map, if you become lost, you can check your current position objectives on the map. If you have a treasure map, you won't be able to see the locations of hidden valuables. That's nice. Oh, it... Oh, that's kind of cool. Like, it shows where the... I guess where something I haven't picked up is. That's nice. So if you're running around somewhere, I guess, and you opened up something but forgot to pick it up or killed a villager and didn't realize you had it... Oh, there's a hand grenade I could've used. Oop. <laughs> Leon, you're just tearing up their whole little village now because you're mad. I get it. I'm with you, man. How dare they do all this to me? Let's get the chicken egg. I don't know, we had a... That, that cow helped us out, though. Setting it on fire. I'm just gonna explore and make sure I grab everything before we head on. Didn't make it up here. Ooh. <laughs> I was about to say, this section might be the best place to hold up a vantage point or something. Let's see, do we need a key here? Yeah, we're gonna need a key there. But apparently that it would break, it looks like. Ooh, another plant. Nice. Man, there's a, a nice little uh, plethora of green herbs. I'll take it. Okay, Leon, you need to get your cardio together here, buddy. Aha, uh -huh, what's this? Ooh, ruby. That's a nice. That's a very nice. Handgun ammo. I'll take that. Ten plus one. I wonder if that if it's counting what's in the chamber. That'd be kind of a cool detail. Um Let's see, crafting. How do I make shotgun shells? I need 12 gunpowder. Okay, so I need more gunpowder. Because right now I have one. Or six. So I need six more and I can make my own. I'm playing a little inventory game here. Hold on. I wish they didn't pop up every time. That that might get annoying after a while. All right. Hopefully, I can find some shotgun ammo soon. Insignia. That was the one I got cornered at. In the corner of the village, so. Alright, let's go. What? There ah, it is. The windmill. Ah! 
Ah, save station. Go ahead and do a quick save. Let's see if we can sneak up on a little bit of this. Hopefully. Quiet chicken. I can sneak up on this guy. Ooh. That doesn't look good. Piggies. Why can't I... Oh, is my knife broken? It is broken. Really, Leon? Really? Wow. That's my fault, everybody. Just heard all that. Oh, there's cows and pigs. And there's more eggs. Whoa, ah, ah, ah. Ow. Really? Maybe I broke her neck? I did. Nice. What's this? Okay, it looks like I've got some sort of thing to shoot and get a challenge out of. Ugh. <laughs> nice, more handgun ammo. Some of this egg. Nice. Ah. Blue request notes. You can take on tasks by collecting the blue request notes posted around in different areas. View the requests you've taken in the files menu. For the love of God, will somebody please get rid of the blue medallions? Those religious lunatics left hanging around. Destroy the blue medallions. Okay. Well, I'm close to doing that. This looks like it's being gated off, so... I guess I can't go through there yet. Oh, I can... Oh, oh, what's this? Oh, crap. I wonder if I can disarm it. Oh, I can't. Nice! Hooray! Ah, good, a yellow herb. Alright, so... Okay, so next time I need a full heal, I'll use that, and I'll expand my health in the process. Alright, uh, of course, puzzle time. Ah, nice. Was it a cog? It looks I'll like a... everything myself. Yeah. Oh, I got a grenade. Let's check over here. Some boxes to break. I wish there was like a sidestep button. Are you dead? Yep. Nine gunpowder. I hear someone behind me, but. I want to look through this stuff first before I try to find them. Whoa. Hold on. Oh god, what are you? Sorry. 
<laughs> oh man, he blew off his leg. I'll take that. Oh yeah, suplex. Oh gosh. Are y'all done? Can, can I... Can I... Hang out and do stuff without y'all going after me? Please? Ah, there's the cog. Wooden cog. Ooh, a kitchen knife. Yeah, let's get that equipped. So that'll break, I can't repair that, from what I understand. Ooh, ruby. Which is fine by me. Man, I'm enjoying this so far. This is amazing. Uh, I did play through Resident Evil 5 recently, in the last little bit here. Like a month ago, or almost two months ago. Just to kind of get back into that mindset, as it were, but I didn't want to do anything um, to play this, the original, and be like, well, this is have it too close to my brain. Oh, a key, huh? In familiarity. I know some people would like to do that, but I did I did not want to do that. Um, keep this as fresh of a new experience as I could. Now, I bet I could, if I was clever, I could have walked back here, shot that explosive, and it would have um, gone off. Aha! And hurt any of these guys that I needed to injure. What have we got back here? A flagon. Nice. Can I combine anything with it yet? Nice. So if I wanted to... Yay, the value's gone up. Hooray! The merchant will be so happy about that once I find the merchant. Aha! Uh -huh. Now we will continue on as soon as I find... There's like two more of those blue coins. Is there anything on my map? Oh, it does show that. That's nice. Okay. Ugh. So is it in here? Or is it on the other side, maybe? Hand grenade. No, it seems to be like... Ah, there it is. <coughs> And then the last one is back over here. Oh, I guess I ran past it. So, pardon me, everybody. And you cows. Well, excuse me. Official business of the FBI, CIA, secret organization. Known as whatever we are. And that being said saying that I played Resident Evil 5, I don't want them to go and remake that. Of all the games to remake, they... I've said it before. And I'll keep saying it. It needs to be, uh... It needs to be... Well, why am I... I'm, <laughs> sorry, I'm going blank. I'm thinking about something else in my head. It needs to be Code Veronica. There you are. Nice. Because, uh, the history of Resident Evil 4 is that originally they were trying to have, like, a fixed camera, d fixed dynamic camera. Um, and it didn't really work out in this gothic setting, and actually that, whatever they were working on became Devil May Cry. However, in Code Veronica, which was originally a Dreamcast title, which Dreamcast was a failed Sega product, for all those who don't know it. Um, they got ports, and so you can actually get it now still for, the, like, the PlayStation 4 on the PlayStation Store, and it's such a good game. 
Um, it's got something similar where it's a fixed camera, this fixed dynamic camera angle. And can I jump from here? No. We'll just jump through here. Um, and it was so good, and it's Claire's story. She's the main protagonist, and that would be so perfect for them to kind of continue on. Like, well, we did Leon's story. Ooh. This is cool. So let's do, let's do, uh, Claire's. That looks like something we can't get into right now. Might have to do some inventory management here in a second. Let's see what's over here. Which way am I supposed to go? Okay, so that blocks off there. We're supposed to go this way. So let's take a gander over here, see if there's anything interesting. It's like a gondola. Kind of reminds me of that little hub area in uh, Resident Evil Village, where it's like, well, okay, here's the little hub that gives you to all the different quote-unquote biomes in Resident Evil Village. But I'm very happy. This is amazing. This looks. This game is amazing. It looks amazing, and it's fun to play so far. Ugh. And it feels so fresh, and it feels like this... I mean, as it should, it feels like a brand new game. But I do find it funny how this is the season, or the year thus far, of remasters. Because this is remastered, Dead Space got its remaster, and that was beautiful. Metroid Prime got a remaster. I never played it originally on the GameCube. Yeah. Oh. Oh. <laughs> I pressed, I was tapping the circle button, hoping that I would do something more than just kind of crouch down, but I guess I evaded it enough. Eesh. Oop. You're dead. Will you fall down too? Nice. Break your neck on the way down. I swear she just said Buenos Aires. Um. But yeah, Metroid Prime was good. A little, a couple things I wish they would have fixed about it. The twins, the being able to use uh, the dual twin sticks. Not like twin stick shooter, but actually like, uh, ooh, bath? But use them like a modern FPS did make the difference. Because I did play it originally on the GameCube, and I was like, I don't like this thing with the, uh, ooh. With the dual sticks. Not being able to... Uh-oh. Can I shoot that? Ah, crap. Now, it would be... I wonder if I could throw that back. That would be great. Come on, light. Oh, crap. Where did that come from? Ow, buddy. Okay, now. Whoop. There's a lot of guys here. Hold on. Let's just go ahead and... Well, that wasn't that much. Huh. You get a lot of handgun ammo out of that. Come on. Here, chew on that. I need more... Oh, that guy's just kind of hanging out there, isn't he? Oh gosh, there's another grenade here. Another bear trap. How? You know what, lady? It's not very hospitable. Oh gosh, really? Ow! 
Come on, break her dick. Okay. Let's see, can I shoot? Yes, it did work. Ow, at my expense. Note to self, don't do that so close again. Yeah, I'll go ahead and use that. Oh, I guess I should have eaten the chicken egg. Felt like I can make an omelet. Jeez. Yeah, I'll take the shotgun shells. It sounds like she's seeing something else, like Ariba a hole. Come on. <laughs> what, there's more guys here? Jeez. Let's get up here. And more. Oh, wow, she just got blown in half. Let's check out this door. I know we can't go through it. Yeah, we'll need a key. But just wanted to go ahead. Hopefully, he's marked that on his map or something. Ooh, there's a trap right there. Watch out, Leon. Come on, I'm trying to shoot the... Oh, never mind, I guess it's gone. Yeah, it disappeared. I was hoping to be able to shoot that stick of dynamite, but I guess it disappeared. Here. This the place? Look, here's another one of those altars. <laughs> is it marked? Okay, it is marked on my map. Door with insignia. Oh, I'm missing a. <sighs> Let's run back and get that real quick. <clears throat> Don't want to leave all that. <clears throat> oh, really? Is that, I wonder if that's how much that's hurting me. It seems to be just a huge inconvenience. Man, there's a lot of bear traps. Is this where it was all right over here? I guess from these guys that I killed with an explosive, and I guess I just didn't grab their stuff. Oh, come on, come on. All right. Nope, can't get in that way. Oh yeah. I'm gonna pilfer first. To make my way around. Uh oh. I hear explosives. We gotta be careful. Runs right into them. Huh. Too bad I can't, like, take that with me. Make it a grenade or something. Hello, what's all this? It's like science tools. Mm, and a creepy doll. A little dirty one, at least. Huh. We find out that that's a founder of Umbrella. The Ashfords. What's that noise? Oh, thanks for the shotgun shells. Oh gosh, really? You say what? Yeah. 
And he worked so hard hammering that together, too. Oh, well. That's how I feel sometimes. Hello? Anybody home? Hello? Uh-oh. What's this? That hurts, you know? It seemed like you really wanted to talk. How observant, senor. Now, uh, say, uh, you got a smoke? You know, those things will kill you. Oh, well, maybe just untie me then, huh? Joder, not this guy! Who are you? Okay, stop right there! Oh no. Chapter end. <laughs> that's it for the game, folks. Uh, we died. <laughs> All right, that's great. We're actually going to stop there for today. Thanks for watching Storytime Gamer. Like, subscribe, hit the bell notification. I'll catch you on the next episode. Thank you.